Hey guys, Nate Walker of Nate Walker Properties uh, at Remax Alliance. I just wanted to uh, make a little video and talk about one of the areas that we cover, um, and that is uh, Covington, Louisiana. Uh, I really love Covington. I think it's a great destination spot. Uh, it's got a lot to offer, and I kind of want to talk a little bit about that. So that and really why people love to call Covington home. So if you're considering a move to Covington or the North Shore, uh, you really can't overlook this spot. It's a unique blend, uh, pretty much like no other place. It's a city that's over 200 years old, yet it still feels like the new girl on the scene. Covington has managed to resist falling into the trap of the typical suburban sprawl that you find with most commuter cities. It's located just a short drive across the Causeway Bridge, north of New Orleans, uh, and it's, it's a perfect commuter city when I say that. It's the proximity of New Orleans, nightlife, you have a short drive to Baton Rouge if you're an LSU Tigers fan. Uh, the beaches and casinos of the Gulf Coast are easily accessible right down the interstate in a quick afternoon or a quick drive uh, down the road. You can get to them and back very easily. So it's, it's easy to see why Covington has the draw and the allure that it does when people are considering where to locate onto the North Shore. Now, it's also situated in St. Tammany Parish, which boasts some of the best public schools in the state. So Anytime you've got good schools and good proximity to major metropolitan areas and good jobs, you're going to get you know, a great spot to be. And because of that, uh, Covington has a fantastic real estate market. Uh, the market here is actually really, really strong. It has a really solid um, average sales price of a little over $300,000. But don't let that you know, deter you when looking for a home in Covington if that's a little bit out of your budget because there's over 970 homes currently for sale in Covington. Now, with that number of homes available, there's bound to be something in your price range, whatever that price range may be. So now we've talked a little bit about Covington, where it's at, why it's desirable. Let's talk about why it's really desirable, and that's the, um, the, the, the aspect of enjoyment of life there. So for instance, you know, downtown Covington is really what gives Covington its unique feel and, and character. And with that, you have to talk about the Bogafalaya River, which dissects the heart of Covington and downtown Covington. There is a fantastic pavilion and park uh, right on the banks of the Bogafalaya, where twice a year they hold a uh, the Sunset at the Landing, which is a biannual concert series that's free to the public. So, I mean, who doesn't like to go spend their evenings listening to live music, you know, with, with beautiful scenery in the backdrop? So beyond that, just a short walk from there, you've got the heart of downtown Covington, which is currently just experiencing a fantastic renaissance and boom right now. You've got antique shops, high-end boutiques, coffee shops, art galleries. Um, I mean, you can't really have a, a, a downtown area going through a, a renaissance without having a, you know, a very active farmer's market that holds and meets weekly. Uh, in addition to that, the local businesses downtown hold a sort of homage to New Orleans White Linen Night where they open up the doors of the shops in the evening and everybody comes out and walks the streets and just basically has a wonderful uh, good time with libations in hand as we walk around and enjoy uh, the nightlife in the downtown Covington district. Now, I, I like to eat. I'm a, I'm a big foodie. I spend a lot of time uh, working in restaurants and I enjoy that. So for me, having a strong restaurant scene is very, very important. Uh, I like to go out and have dinner and cocktails uh, with, with, with my wife and my friends as well. So, for instance, you've got Lola, which is downtown in my favorite lunch spot, located and situated in an old train car, which is unique and fun. Uh, they also serve dinner. Um, they bake all their own bread and house. I love that place. Uh, if you're looking for more formal and uh, Italian fare, you've got uh, Restaurante del Porto, which is, you know, great local, you know, ingredients with an Italian feel, handmade pasta is really awesome stuff. Now, if you want something that's more modern and um, new age, I guess you could say, but yet it's still going to be really, really delicious. You look directly across the street and there's Oxlot 9, which is a relatively new restaurant. It's been around for just a couple of years now. And they are really, really pushing the envelope of what Covington and North Shore cuisine is. They've got a wonderful craft cocktail program. And they're also the anchor restaurant for the Southern Hotel. Uh, Southern Hotel is a very, very old hotel in downtown Covington that just underwent a multi-million dollar uh, renovation. Uh, it drips Southern charm. It's 
a fantastic place if you want to just have like a little weekend getaway without having to go anywhere you can do it right there and it's it's a great spot it's really really pretty they hold you know events all the time they've got a fantastic bar uh, outdoor patio area now if you're like me and you like to cook there's this great little spot downtown Covington where you know people that live there love to shop it's called the Quista Paces I know that sounds crazy but it actually um, is easier to say than it is to spell trust me I, uh, I have tried several times but why I like Quista Paces is because they're going to have unique ingredients that no one else has they're going to stock the shelves with things that no one else will, will, will put out there. Um, it's really, really a great selection of unique items, as well as boasting the one of the largest wine and spirit uh, selections in the Southeast. So, you know, we are in Southeast Louisiana. We like to have a good time. We like to eat well and we like to drink well. So Aquista Paces serves uh, that purpose completely. Now, like I said, Covington has a little bit of everything to offer. It's a great spot. There's history, there's elegance, there's charm. So if you're considering a move to the North Shore, you really can't overlook Covington or at least give it some serious consideration. Now you can always go to natewalkerproperties.com, search for your dream home, find your home that you want to buy. Uh, we offer the ability to search everything in the MLS. You can see everything that we can see. Create a profile, save properties. If you need to get financing, we have multiple lending partners on our site. So you can request financing, fill out applications and get that rolling. We work with uh, Scott Finkley at Integra Lending. We work with um, Brad Perry at Ace Mortgage. We work with Dwayne Stein at Cross Country Mortgage. So there's a lot of options to, uh, to help you get you where you want to go. In addition to that, we have a lot of resources on the site, such as a video series uh, that explains the seven steps in buying a home, basically what you got to do to get ready and how you get there to go from I want to buy a house to I bought a house. Uh, we outline all of that for you. There's also a complete guide to selling your home. So if you're already here and you need to relocate or just kind of move around or, you know, move up or downsize or whatever it might be, you can download the complete guide to selling your home. You can actually request a valuation directly from the site and we'll get back to you and get something set up for you. Or you can just reach out to us on Facebook at, and then the website is natewalkerproperties.com or you can call or text me at 985-205-0014. So we look forward to seeing you on the site. We look forward to uh, talking to you and we look forward to uh, helping you get you where you want to go. Have a great day, guys. Take care.